What's up guys, hope you're doing great. This is Kobe Shots and I'm taking you through my BTS or the behind the scenes of how I shot a quick commercial for Chicken Man here in Kumasi. And um, I used some continuous lights, not just natural lights, even though I shot outside. I chose to shoot outside because of um, the lighting conditions and to also serve as convenience for the customers because it was actually a working day. So you see me putting together my gear. I use the 16 to 35 2.8 L series lens from Canon coupled with my GH5 which I use as my workhorse for filmmaking. And I mounted it on a gimbal which I predominantly used, the Ronin S from DJI. Okay, so the first thing that I did before starting the show was to look at how the the whole environment was going to look like with my talent seated um, right behind her laptop which was a concept and I took some few shots of how the sun was going to look like um, for some introductory parts of the video which actually made it to the cut. So what I'm doing right now is I'm taking some shots of the sun again in a different position from the top to below for variety. As I kept on shooting, I repositioned the light so that I could find the perfect lighting positioning so I could get the right shots. So I took several introductory shots right from the sun all the way to reveal my talent seated in front of a table behind the laptop. So this is actually how it looks like. I continued with the sequence. So this was actually a concept that I put together and I presented it to the restaurant and they were pleased with it and so they gave us that opportunity to shoot it. So I continued to take some shots of the table and what was present on it. It's all hard to feel together as everything occurring within the very first minute. So you see me holding my hand over my lens because I didn't come with a lens hood. So I could get some consistency in the lights outpour. And also, um, I took some shots of while typing on the laptop, you know, telling the story that she was actually working while waiting for her order to be brought to her. Okay, so I kept on taking some shots and still waiting for the right time. So you can see I employed one of the employees <laughs> to help me out with a storyline. He didn't have any idea before, but I got him on board and he was pleased to help me out. And so yeah, I took several shots. This I think is the third or the fourth trial which made it to the cut. I took her reaction when her food was brought to her. I was directing the waiter as to how to position the food right in front of her. So she had to clear her desk to make room for the food to be set right next to her. So we're just about to start eating or start digging in the food. My talent got herself ready and we had to take several shots. Because of that, we made sure that we wouldn't take too many bites. But to make sure that the storyline had its consistency in accordance with the shots I was taking, we made sure that the bites were kind of moderate. But at a point, we had to change the chicken wing because the shots that we got were not as satisfying as we wanted, so we took several. And now you see me taking shots of her reaction to the food, telling that she's really enjoying it. And I shot some from below as well to get variety. And I think this was the best, which made it to the last cut. Okay, so this next shot was sped up, or I made a time lapse of it to make it seem as if she picked up the piece of chicken one after the other, consuming them one after the other. But in truth, as you can see in the behind the scenes, we picked them up and put them on something else. I kept on moving in an orbit to ensure that I had more coverage of the chicken pieces until the last one was picked up. Now to the last take, you notice that back there or in the background beyond the lights are pitch black because we actually ran out of time and due to that we had to quickly do it and I framed out lots of the shots to hide the time of day that we shot so we actually lost time but still came out great.
all right so this brings us to the end of the video thank you very much for sitting through to the very end subscribe to my channel if you haven't and turn on the post notification button to always be notified of future videos that i'll be uploading over here and just as always until the next video have a great day see ya